Good morning everyone and welcome to Borderlands 2. Uh, there are a few problems with me doing this game at the moment. I'm going out tomorrow, as in to London, away from my computer, which is really annoying because it means I can't play this. Uh, so what I'm going to do is, because I'm playing this on release day, on like immediately, uh, I'm going to do a first impressions series and then I'm going to do a co-op playthrough with Jack who I did well I was partially doing Borderlands 1 uh, playthrough with uh, which we have since stopped doing because uh, he's played it too many times um, I'm sure we'll be talking about it when we do the co-op but um, yeah that's the reason for Borderlands 1 stopping uh, but anyways let's get into this new game um, so, I'm looking forward to playing to it story, but, yeah, huh? no one where the very fate of Pandora hangs in the balance. Nope. It's not too bad, I'm telling you anyway. Oh, wow. First, there was the vault. An alien prison, open with a mystical key. To the warriors who opened it, the vault was just a container of tentacles and disappointment. They vanished into the wastelands, certain that the vault held no treasure at all. They were wrong. Very the vault's wrong. opening triggered the growth of Iridium, a priceless alien element. Soon, the rare and valuable mineral emerged all across Pandora. Its appearance attracted many, including the Hyperion Corporation. They came to Pandora to mine Iridium and bring order to the savage planet. Through their excavations, Hyperion uncovered evidence of an even greater vault. Their leader vowed to find it, to use its power to civilize the Borderlands, once and for all. But Hyperion weren't the only ones searching for the next vault's alien power. The call of danger and loot is not so easily resisted. Certain warriors came to Pandora in droves to uncover its hidden secrets. Some would call them adventurers. Others call them fools, but I call them Vault Hunters. Our story begins with them, and with a man named Handsome Jack. Doesn't really look that handsome on that picture, to be honest. Probably gave him that name to himself. A bit vain. This thing doesn't look too healthy at the moment. Oh wait a minute, is he going to get run over? I'm pretty sure one gets run over in the start of the first one. So is this like... Is he going to get run over? No? Well, he got knocked out. What's the chain? Is he going to get dragged? Yep. I thought so. This guy's getting messed up. This weirdo again. Wow. Really? This this guy reminds me of Grunt from Halo. He's like small and just completely random and erratic. Whoa! What the hell? Uh. <laughs> wow. Oh, okay. Ouch. It's gotta hurt. Anyways, I'm really looking forward to this game. Or well, I was looking forward to this game. I'm looking forward to playing it. Because I've heard nothing but good from it. Um, I know various people have got it early. Um, and I think America got it uh, like uh, half a day earlier than we did here in the UK, which is a shame, but oh well, you got to get on with it. Uh, I've even stayed up until midnight so I can play this. I mean, I, I'm supposed to have school tomorrow, but screw school, this is more important. Who, who doesn't like a bit of Borderlands 2 and this guy's a bit... Whoa, look at that thing. Axton is the commander. Wow, that's pretty beast. This is Siren. This is Siren. The sound usually the girls. Yep. 
Uh huh, yep, there we go. Maya. Who's this guy? Ooh. What else I found? Salvador the Gunzerker. Interesting. Uh, and this is a new one, I think. The like, ninja type thing. God sword. Yep. Invisi guy. Oh, what moves. Oh, that beach moves there. I like it. Wow, really? Zero is a number. Alright, whatever. Anyways, the intention of me playing this game is just to get my first impressions of it. Well, do I have a handsome, handsome chat guy? Has he got springs out in full? Whoa. Welcome to Pandora, kiddos. Oh wow, what a douche. Hmm. Well, this isn't a good start. Anyways, back to what I've been trying to say for the last three. Oh, we got to pick a thingy. I don't know, I like the look of the Gunzerker, but I kind of like the Commando. Combat style. Keep to cover, not really my style. Long range, nah. Uh, yeah, I like this guy. I'll take this one. Can we change the name? Oh, oh, you can change stuff. Okay. Red Dwarf. Oh, customization. I like it. Wasn't that much customization in the first one. So that's uh, that's no, it's a plus from the last game. They've improved it. What is this? Oh yes, he's got a ginger beard. The Salvador. I'm gonna have to call him McBeast as always. You can have different heads. Oh, he's got a cap. He's bald. Whoa. Okay. Uh, I'll take that. Yeah. Right, so the purpose of this series is just to get a first impression of the game. I'm not. This won't be the proper playthrough. I'm going to do a co-op playthrough. Wow, thanks. Indeed. We have heard nothing but good things from this game. Like it's got good reviews, and people are saying it's really good, uh, well ported on the PC, which is good because I'm playing it on the PC, obviously. I still hate claptrap. So annoying. Oh yeah, sure. Ten health? That's BS. Okay. Uh, thank you. Didn't really read what that said. Wow. This guy's a weirdo. Oh, hell yeah. Oh man, she's hot. I'll take it. Yeah, yeah, you can help me. Hmm. Anyways, what I've been trying to say for the last five times or something, I'm doing this as a first impression series. Uh, not a proper series. I'm going to be doing a co-op with Jack. Uh... I'm sure it will be. But yeah, I'm just getting a feel for the game before I start playing. I, th I expect the uh, proper playthrough to be coming out on Tuesday. I'm going to upload this like immediately after I've finished. Um, just so I've got something up at Borderlands. Because I was advised to do so by a guy who works for Machinima. Who helped me. Oh, money. 20 20 dollars? Why not pounds? Pounds are better. No offence to the Americans, of course, but I just like them British. What do you expect? Ooh, look at all this ammo. Wow. Alright, okay, cool. Pretty safe, huh?